Happy holidays, Chris Lamb with Commerce Home Mortgage. This is the year end last market update we're gonna do for the year of 2019 and I can't believe how fast it's gone by. What I'd like to do is a quick year in review and then talk about 2020. Uh, now if you think about it, this year has been a pretty crazy year in real estate if you pay attention to any of this, uh, any of the subjects within real estate. This time last year, interest rates were 1% higher than they are today. Uh, we've seen about a 7% appreciation in Shasta County. Uh, throughout the state of California, it's been a little bit less or more, but it's been a pretty good year overall. Uh, when a lot of experts thought that prices could slow or go down, uh, it's still been very, very strong. Um, right now, currently in December of 2019, here in Shasta County, we're seeing the inventory is a little bit light. A lot of that's typical for this time of year, and as we head into next year, we'll see a lot of new construction coming into the marketplace uh, early in the year. But what I really want to focus on is interest rates, uh, because that's a big topic right now. Everyone's asking, what do you think rates are, due, are going to do next year? Is it a good time to refinance now? Should we wait till next year? And the answer that I have for that is, is somewhat uh, sarcastic and expected, but uh, they're going to go up or they're going to go down. And we really don't know what's going to happen next year. Uh, there's a lot of people that are predicting that if uh, Donald Trump is voted in, we will see a lot of the same things we saw this year, next year. But I would say unanimously, most experts in this, uh, in the real estate industry or in uh, the securities and bond markets are thinking that mortgage rates will most likely stay in a pretty low spot heading into next year and well throughout next year. And so what that means, we really don't know. They could be a little higher, they could be a little bit lower, but for most people right now, if you own a house and you haven't refinanced, you should really look at it. And for people that are renting, that are looking at what it costs to rent a house right now, especially with uh, rent control going into place next year, a lot of people aren't real happy with what they're seeing in the rental market. So again, it's a really good time, uh, end of the year, beginning of the year, when taxes are being filed to look at what it looks like uh, to buy a house versus renting. So other than that, I just want to wish everyone a happy holidays and a happy new year. If there's ever anything you need from me, please feel free to give me a call here at the office and I hope you're having a great day.